morning everybody how is all going today well it's good seeing a blue sky we haven't seen that for quite a few days uh, the batteries are performing absolutely excellent we're down to 50 percent um, yesterday it was a oh, terrible day terrible day but we managed without needing to start a generator yeah it's just been awful absolutely awful okay ah uh, so anyway one of the packages i've been waiting for to uh, finish the dc wiring has arrived that's a big one that's a monster package look at the size of this look at the size of this let's uh let me put the camera down why i sort this tough plastic stuff now what's inside inside this box is a 1000 amp bus bar 1000 amp a sticker just in case you want to mount it upside down now this is a what's called this is what's called a lynx power in and it's rated at 1000 amps so this is what they look like people again it's really hard to do this one-handed but i'll manage and this is absolutely huge okay let me uh get a ruler so you can just have a look at the size of this and the size of the bus bars um, to give you some idea just how heavy duty this all is. right so this is just a bus bar now because i have people from the us and england watch my channel this is in both um, metric this tape measure and inches so it's 30 centimeters from one end from the very tip of the bus bar so there's about 30 centimeters uh, or a bit under one foot okay now i've taken the loosened the screws already let's first of all see if the screws are retained very important excellent so you don't have to worry about losing the screws now internally internally these bus bars are three There you go, you can see, can they see the measurements of that? Yeah. Okay, my wife's holding the camera by the way, people, so remember to thank her for holding the camera so we can get all these measurements. Now it's got, these are meant to be removable, yes it is. Now I'm just using this as a bus bar. So I'll probably be coming off this end and leaving these covers on this end um, to get the facing the right way. And that's fine. But if you're using it, um, typically your blue C um, shunt that measures all the amps would be at this end and you take your power off. And at this end, yeah, it's, it's a real weird way they set it up, but I, I think your shunt always goes to the left on these. I'm not sure, someone can correct me for that. Um, I just, I don't know, I don't know enough about them. But it's got massive inlets, okay, this is, these are these removed by the way people. You, these just lift up and you put your, your negatives in the bottom and you put that down again 
and your positives lays in the top. You've probably got to break these little bars off out of the way just for the ones you're using. But that's pretty good. So this is your positive bus bar underneath here is your negative All bus right. bar. So I've started work um, on a little mod on the uh, Lynx Powering 1000. Okay the uh, Victron and what I've done is I've removed that screw there that screw there that screw there and that screw there that allows me to lift this out okay now if you have a look in there there's ha hexagonal they're not round okay so what I'm going to do is drop a bolt in there all right, and this has already got a spring washer and a normal washer on it. So when I do, the, do it up, it'll all pull up tight. And I just drop those in. And these are all M8 <coughs> stainless steel. And uh, they've got the uh, stainless steel spring washer and washer underneath them. Um, and the top has got a locking um, skirt on the nut okay and then all I do is I very carefully drop back that, that into the top now what that'll do is well, I'll fasten this back down again but I'll just show you real quick okay so I'll bring the negative in here okay to the bottom which is the negative bus bar okay and then the positive will come across to this one here I'll have to put another nut there to, to raise it a bit but that's fine there's plenty of thread on this and then the positive will come across to this 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 line here okay and then between there sorry I'm just trying to get the camera angle right I'm doing this by myself and then from there to there I will put a fuse hey I'm back yep okay now there's the there's the mod complete now as you can see the negative will come in under under here under this this bolt under here and then you fold that down and the positive will come in under that M8 bolt up there all right and then it goes across to the main uh, positive bus with fuses and that's just a simple mod that doesn't take long to do um, the hardest part's finding the right fuses I've got a big big box of fuses in here and none of them fitted um, so I slipped in the J car and they had the right ones in stock um, and I've got a uh, I took the last of their stock and I uh, back ordered a few more for spares okay YouTube so there's a simple uh, bus bar mod for added safety on the uh, Victron Energy Lynx power in 1000 amp bus bars. Ah, I hope you've enjoyed that. It's all come all cloudy outside, but that's fine. We're nearly full anyway. Um, if you enjoyed this video, uh, please give it a uh, thumbs up or a thumbs down if you didn't enjoy it. Whatever turns you on, I don't mind at all. Both ways helps my channel out. And uh, please comment. That really helps my channel. Siggy and I really appreciate it if you just comment or leave a smiley face or whatever. It just, just really, really does help our channel grow. All right. Keep safe, everyone. Bye for now.